But we can name it. I think it's uh, too much stuff. Okay. Yes, I'm here. Okay. Okay, we're rolling. Okay, G13. Third fret bar chord, pinky on 5B. Mm -hmm. Low first, low E first. <laughs> It's only this shape and this shape. So G. So you don't, because you don't want it to sound like you're just letting up on them. Same on the B. G string, 4 to an open. D string, 3 to an open. The beginning. 3B, 4G. One hit, then third finger will go to the, the fifth fret. Same two. Once, 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 twice. Does it again. section. First finger, seventh fret, top two, slide to eight. Third finger, B and G, ten. First finger, eight B, second finger, nine G. Right. Third finger on tenth fret. Back where you were, eight, nine, but slide up to it. Slide down, second finger, it's the same two. First finger, the same two on the fifth fret. Hit that again after the third finger, seven D. Back to the first thing we did once instead of twice. That time we leave that the end one off instead of this. Here's your time to get up here. First finger to nine G. We'll go frets nine, ten, eleven with fingers one, two, and two. The first finger will go onto the high E, one fret below, on 10. Hit the G and go down, fret by fret. High E in the same position. Same thing, but start on 7, go up to 9. Okay, that's 9, 7. Next one goes down two frets. This is down two frets every time. First finger, then second, and second, on 5, 6, and 7. This time, high E parallel, high E. Frets 2, 3, and 4 on the G, fingers 1, 2, and 2. First finger, high E3, second finger, or pinky, 5B. 